Okay, welcome ladies and excuse me. Welcome ladies and gentlemen to another messed up hair day episode of This Is Our Life. Okay. We're cleaning up, we're getting ready for um an inspection. And um <clears throat> since I'm taking our survival gear, our bug out gear and survival gear out of the bedroom, I thought I'd go ahead and give you a quick video of um, what I have here. I'm not going to show you everything because, like so many others have said, you know, this is a process. Well, lucky in the cats are knocking stuff down, people. Anyway, um, I'm not going to show you everything because, frankly, right now, Everything's not where it should be or where it would normally be. So I'm just going to give you a quick overview here. And I apologize. I don't have a shirt that I can grab. So, you know, but I do have pants on. And I actually have some slippers on as well. And my hair, I'm about to just pull it all out. See, I have pants on, okay? I don't worry about it. My beard is longer, is so long I can't fit it all into the screen. This right here, there are two sleeping bags in here. This is a sleeping bag container or bag, a bag for your sleeping bag. And have it on the Alice pack with um, just, you know, cheap um, straps from Walmart. And they work just fine too. Um, this would go. This would probably lay something like that on the pack. The only problem is, I don't know if you can see it. This is where you put like your your identification or put your name so you know who's is who's. All I have to do is reverse this. And this will be underneath. I don't know if that would cause any reflection or or what, but okay. now this is a little easier. Okay. Um this is the bag. What I have on here are four of these sustainment pouches. This one is first aid supplies. There are gloves. There's a first aid kit. And there's there's some other things in here as well, but this is a, is a belt pouch. You see what's for the most part you can see what's in there, stethoscope, scissors, clamps, and um there's other stuff in there. I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to show you everything right now. Um, um, this, just a bungee cord. <coughs> the reason for that is, you know, like, if we had to cross a waterway and we had wet socks, we could just stick them in there to dry. Um, like I said, there are four of these. There's a, this sustainment pouch that you can't see on this side. does have food in it. These two sustainment pouches have, guess what? Nothing. Well, what I want to do, everything's not in the main bag either. What I want to do with the sustainment pouches, with these two, I want to move. I'm not sure where yet. I don't want to move them. Also, I don't know if you can see it. Right here is the sheath with the machete in it and the handles on over on this side. I would prefer this, the machete, be on the uh, assault kit rather than the bug out bag, but you have to put things where you can put them. Also, that's the thing we need. This? Perfect arch. Oh. Hat cap. Oh. 
I think he'd like that. Oh, yeah. Especially J-O-H-N. Mr. Rub Rub. <laughs> you can probably help with the hairball, too. Mm, oh, yeah. An old baggy push. Yeah, people are... Eldest cat, which is only she a year. a lot. Yeah, she pukes a lot. She's only a year older than the other ones. I mean, those are her uh, babies. The only thing I don't like about this this case right here is it. Well, now it's not going to do it, but it usually it's not tight enough. It just yeah, it just doesn't snap. Sometimes it doesn't snap, and now it is snap, but it usually comes off far too easily. And I put an Alice clip right there. And this has to go on the assault kit. This does not go on the bug out bag. Probably cheap snaps. Yeah, I think you're right. And I mean, otherwise it seems sturdy weight. enough. But you know, th this has some weight to it. Not uh, not a lot, but they, then they, you know, you get this little pouch. You know, I mean, you, you need something to cover oh, the blade. Oh, back to tool. Oh, oh it's right here. It. My wife found my tool. After I went through the washing machine. Every time I lose it, guess how we find it? In the wash. But it's been like... Well, I don't know what the hell you do with it. No, I don't, I don't know. know. So, this has to go on the assault kit. I'm not going to show you the assault kit. It's still in the bedroom. It's coming out. Let's see, if I do this too much with it, these, buttons, these snaps will just unsnap. Well, yeah. So, I don't, I don't know how I'm going to attach it to anything at this point because yeah because I, I mean but. you know I can still clip this on but I'm probably gonna have to see I can't really show you here let me see if I stand over here well with the assault kit I don't want to do it this way but I can stick it in the belt between me and the belt but um I really don't want to do it that way because it's liable to fall out, and if the pouch, if the case comes off, then it, it's, you know, I don't want a, my belly to be opened. So, anyway, so I don't know how I'm going to do that. But this is an Alice pack. I guess a medium Alice pack or small Alice pack. Got it at the uh, thrift store here in town or the, what, um, the Red Shed. Before they moved uh, to their current location, which is just less than a block away from where they were. But the other one is now. Yeah, the other one is more of a. Now. Yeah, it's a, the other one's a junk shop now. But um, you no, know, that's uh, that's the bag. There are two sleeping bags in here. Not one. The reason for that is because we don't have. A winter sleeping bag for either one of us and it's what, what did I, I, I saw earlier it's in the 80s in Texas right now yet we're getting awfully close to freezing at night with us and my wife said earlier that we have had it's going down like 36 tonight 36 yes yeah, so we're really close to I'm sick of it. Um, I'm early for it. but this so you know you have Two sleeping bags in this, believe me, it fits. I mean, it actually fits in this outer bag better than the inner bag, which is a stuff sack, a military um, stuff sack, a sleeping bag, compression bag for your sleeping bag. But I put two of them in there, so it's been on the large size side. Uh, one other thing is I took, when I do show you the... Um, the um, assault kit. I took the um, another compression bag and attached attached it to the bottom of the butt pack to hold the um, the poncho liner and the poncho. And I can put some other things in there. But this is what what we have right now. I just wanted to show you, make a quick video. Sorry about the belly in the chest, but eh. 